Hi class 9 and 10 students welcome back to Bimal Sarji YouTube channel this is question number 2a exercise 13.3 geometry triangle Vedant excel in mathematics this is compulsory math class 9 and in this video I am going to um, solve all the questions but uh, I will create in such a way that you can watch individual video also and uh, complete video also my यो video लाई ना part part में आए ना इलाय record कर चु रा प्रत्येक part वाइज बन तब पहले playlist में पानो सकनुं चा रा single सब भाई यानी कि L number समझ चा सब भाई योटे video में तब पहले पानो सकनुं चा तब पहले जून मन पार्श त्यो गायरा हैरनु वाला है मैं body ऐस में प्रत्येक video में क्या बोलना चाहिए ना बस है ला तब पहले योटा demo अस्ति मेले गरे को थी तीस्ती video बनाऊं here the question is find the unknown size of angle in the following figures. Okay, so this is the figure. Now we can see here. This is yes. This is the tri okay, triangle. This is P, Q, R, and yes. Then you can see this is Y and this is X and this is P. And this is the symbol for what? Isosceles triangle. This is isosceles triangle. That means base angles are equal. So what I am going to do here, I will apply this formula here. X plus 1. Here you can write here. X plus 110 degree is equal to 180 degree. Okay, this is called linear pairs. Okay, linear. Linear pairs. Okay, linear pairs are supplementary. Okay, that means 180 degree. This is. So this is now here. X is equal to this is 180 degree. And this is plus 110 degree. It when it comes to this side, it is minus 110 degree. Uh, therefore, x is equal to 180 minus 110 degree. This is 70 degree. So I got one answer. X is equal to 70 degree. Now y is equal to y is equal to x is equal to 70 degree. Okay. I'll write here y is equal to x therefore y is equal to x well what is it 7 degree so this is our two number answer here the reason is uh, base angles of base angles of isosceles triangle are equal now z so z now we can write here x plus y plus z is equal to this in this triangle this is 180 degree so we can add reason sum of angles sum of angles in a triangle okay that is equal to 180 degree now when we solve this x value is here 70 degree plus y value is again 70 degree and z value we don't know this is we have to find and this one is really as it is now this is 70 70 140 degree plus z this is z okay 180 degree and this z keep as it is and this is 180 degree and this 140 degree will be this are minus 140 degree therefore z is equal to 180 minus 140 this is 40 degree okay that's why our three answer you can write here uh, therefore x is equal to y is equal to 70 degree and z is equal to you can write here 40 degree okay in the book they have written 70 70 40 that means okay 70 70 40 degree okay so this is the solution